Hey guys, I hope I am in frame. Okay, again, another filming video, another video filmed on my iPhone today. Um, but today we're doing day five for um, our organize it, or not organize January, anyway, 30 bags, 31 bags in 31 days. I'm using the same bag from day four because it's not totally full, so I want to go ahead and fill it up. But I am going to share with you and the project I'm doing. And again, I'm still in my kids' bathroom. If you can see their wonderful, lovely shower curtain behind me. Yesterday, I did another cabinet here. Now we're gonna tackle under the sink in this bathroom. And then hopefully I will be done with the kids' bathroom where I want to organize it. So let's go ahead and get started and show you guys under the sink. Okay, so this is under the sink. It's not really that messy. Um, it's just, Right now things need to be rearranged a little bit better and placed in some different things because I have some more stuff that needs to go under here um, that is not in the other cabinet. Um, those Aveeno and some of those Band-Aids, I want them to go down here. So that's what I'm gonna work on and kind of clean this up a little bit. That way we have access where I can fit more things in here than just what I can. Because under the sink, you've got all the pipes and things to contend with. So uh, basically what's under here is like some mouthwash, which I need to fill up the kids' mouthwash dispensers. I need to get them new ones actually. Dish or hand soap, some more um, method foaming hand soap. We use foaming hand soap in the kids' bathroom. Mouthwash that they cannot stand. Um... Our toilet bowl cleaning brush. Like here's an old bottle that needs to be gotten rid of. So that's kind of what, see we've got that big pipe that we have to fight with. So I'm kind of trying to rearrange things around that pipe and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and get this done for day five and we're going to hopefully have it finished today. Okay guys, so this is the after. Didn't take any time, didn't cost any money. I just rearranged how things were set up in here. So um, I'm gonna go over that. Sorry. I'm gonna go over that with you here really quickly. All oh, these I did buy new. So basically this thing cost two dollars. I bought these two bins and we have like extra night light bulbs in here, command hooks, and then in here we have the Advino bath stuff and some band-aids. I put this bin in front that we already had, so it'll keep these from sliding around. So in here we just have an extra box of band-aids and everything. Now this glass jar is going to be to hold Q-tips and stuff. Toilet bowl brush, cleaners, extra soaps, the wall trimmer, and our Dixie cups are back there. And there'll also be um, toilet bowl cleaner in here. And some counter wipes once I get some purchased for in here. But that is underneath the sink. It was super easy and quick. And it didn't really take that long. So Ooh, I'm going to pop up here. So yeah. Um, hopefully you guys are enjoying these videos that I'm doing. I know the projects aren't these amazing transformations. Some of them are. But... The way I look at it is sometimes you don't need super huge, amazing transformations. You just need little projects that you can get done and you can accomplish in mm, 15 minutes. I'll say 15 minutes or less sometimes to get a project done and it really motivates you to keep going and not want to give up and keep the organizing process going. So I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you back for, whoops, see you back for day number six.